Hey guys, get with me to go shopping in New York City. Okay, today is our third day, well, technically our third day in New York City. And I had so much fun yesterday meeting Scarlett and the whole team. Um, I'll tell you guys all about it. So we first met at Sephora and we filmed some content. Hopefully I can get, um, I still have a few videos that aren't posted. So hopefully I can get them live to show you guys. And then after that, we took a little break. I had that panini thing. It's like the TikTok viral, like tuna cotta panini thing, but I don't like tuna. So I got just the avocado one and it was really good, except it was a little bit cold. I don't know if it was supposed to be like cold or warm or room temperature, but I was expecting it to be like super warm. And then after that, I went to the headquarters of the outset and I got to see what it looked like. It was super cool. It was so freaking nice. And then we made more videos there. Scarlett is very nice, by the way. A lot of you guys were asking. She is the nicest person ever. And then after that, we headed to Little World's Project, which if you didn't know, it's like a custom making, making bracelet like place. It was super fun. I made like two bracelets. There's two on my wrist. One says New York City. One says my name. And then we were doing words that like relaxes your mind. So I did one that says like breathe on it. And then my mom and I left um, like an hour after because we had a reservation at this place for dinner. And it was so freaking good. I feel like New York has like the best Italian food and I love Italian food. But yeah, it was such a fun day. We were so tired though. My mom literally set an alarm for 7 a.m. this morning for some reason. I don't know why. And we both slept through it. So we thought today we just do a relaxing day of shopping and looking around and to just chill a little. Also, if you guys have any like restaurant recommendations in New York City, let us know. Because most of the time, my mom and I just like walk into random restaurants we see on the street and it's always like a hit or miss. So, or any places that we must like visit while we're here. Also, I've been taking so many photos. So if you guys want, you can follow my Instagram. You don't have to. Um, it's in my bio. You can just click on the Instagram icon. Also, I wanted to vlog this trip on YouTube, but there's something wrong with my camera. Like the SIM card just isn't going in. I meant um, the memory card, so I can't film anything. I don't know why, but my hands get so dirty every time I do my makeup. Also guys, I met Christy yesterday. If you guys didn't know, she's also a content creator on TikTok and she is so nice. You guys always say we look like sisters, um, which I don't see it, but a lot of you guys do. Bye guys. The cheer clinic yesterday, I actually kind of ate. So my confidence is going up and I'm pretty happy. So get ready for me for school. The clinic was until 5.30 and my dance class starts at 5, 5 o'clock. So I was like 45 minutes late, but it was fine because I still came to like rehearsal, which is like the most important part. I told my teacher I'm going to be late today and she said it was fine. So, and tomorrow my dance doesn't start till 7 or no, 8. So I'll be fine. There's another girl at the cheer clinic that's also going to be trying out on Friday morning. So I'm not going to be trying about myself. I know all of the, the whole cheer like by myself and I know the whole dance by myself too. And I knew it before the clinic. So now I'm even more prepared. And like all the current cheerleaders said my toe touch was really good. So that really made me happy. I keep just pausing and singing, but I need to stop and actually get ready. I woke up at 5 and then I stayed in bed till 5.30, so now it's 6. This school year is getting really draining, but it's been one of my favorite ones, so I'm just making the best out of it. And, like, I love, like, all my friends and stuff. I'm just tired. We're doing this project in history and I actually don't know what I'm doing. I think I know what we're supposed to be doing, but if I'm doing it wrong, I'm actually gonna freaking cry. It's due on Friday, but I'm not gonna be here on Friday. I'm only coming for first period and I think part of second period because I have to go to the cheer thing before. So she's gonna give me until Monday to finish the project. So me and my mom are gonna work on it. Hopefully like right after I'm done getting ready. It blends out my concealer so well, I love it. I don't know what I'm gonna wear today, but apparently it's like pretty cold. So I have to dress accordingly. So American is so cute and it's her first love song. Like, oh, I'm gonna work on my lashes. Logical reminds me of my best friend because I remember when the song first came out her and I both screamed this in the car and it was like when I think of the song I think of her This is my last q-tip so hopefully I don't need another one so I won't have to go downstairs Again, I don't know if this brush is meant for powder but I'm gonna do it because I want to and it worked good so I assume it's for powder it took me forever to upload my get ready thing for your yesterday. It was like not uploading. And I'm like, girl. And I had my phone just sitting there for like 40 minutes and it was like barely uploading. I let it, the setting powder sit for a second. This looks bad right here because I need to straighten it out again. Why is my TV doing this? 
jib what the flip now like everyone says like the rubbery bush will never run out and i like completely agree there's no way in heck i'm gonna ever finish this but i use so much of the highlighter so i wonder if it's ever gonna run out i, I don't know i feel like i can finish this because i use it so much i have one lash that's been lowered like into my eyeball like right here i think y'all can see that and it hurts and I can't pull it out because it's gonna hurt even more. So I'm just like suffering in pain. I'm really freaking sore. Like I'm like in pain. And then I have competition all weekend and tryouts and just ugh, what the flip. What? Oh. Um chat. Oh. I think I'm dramatic, but I just was that by a guy that my brother said said would date me. Like my brother's friend said date me, he just doesn't have me, so <laughs> him and I go back. So oh. probably this whole part, so I'm going to take the next 15 minutes of my time. Actually, probably 30 minutes of my time trying to find an outfit. So that's it. Bye, guys. Good morning, everyone. Today I'm going down to the farmer's markets and also to breakfast. I don't know if I've ever been to farmer's markets before. Like, I've been to normal type of markets, but never farmer's markets. So it'll be fun. I actually have no clue where I'm leaving. I think it's at 8, maybe. And so that's in 20 minutes. So I have plenty of time. We might be leaving around 8.30. But either way, I'm getting ready way too early. Also, something I've been doing recently is just putting on my blush and my what's it called, bronzer at the same time. I feel like it's just so much easier to blend out. Although maybe I should put on more blush because that barely even shows up. Instead of adding more of my Rare Beauty blush, I'm going to add on some of this Charlotte Tilbury one because this is so pretty. I've been needing a new makeup mirror because the one I've been using now is so like small. It just makes it hard to do my makeup. So I ordered this one like a week ago and it came yesterday. It's nothing like what I thought it would be. So I'm going to try returning it, but I don't know if you can really return a makeup mirror. I don't know, but I'm going to try figuring out how to return it. And I've ordered a new mirror, so hopefully that comes soon. My sister just started using the dice in it, so sorry if that's loud. Okay, I'm just going to quickly add in some powder bronzer over the top. But today is such a hot day. Like sitting here and getting ready, I'm so hot. But that's amazing. I haven't had a nice day in quite a while. My hair always dries so fast. I really should start to bring it before I get ready. Okay, I decided my hair up into this little ponytail. And I am going to put it on some SPF because it's so hot today and I'm not getting burnt. Anyways, that's it. And I hope you all have an amazing day. Hey guys, get ready with me. I look insane. Anyways, um... I don't know what we're doing today. We're going shopping, I guess. I actually, like have been sleeping all break so yeah not a very productive break like i don't know what to talk about because i've literally been doing nothing but we're going okay why is none of this coming out hello anyway we're going to five below dollar tree target and i think afterwards i might go to the mall but i don't know yet um yeah and i still have a haul from like three weeks ago that i haven't done so i'll just do like a huge haul tonight or tomorrow sorry i'm like really like bulky looking but i'm really like oh. also guys my nails have been going straight. this is like week three i think or week two i don't know but my nails have been going strong only one has fallen off and it was during volleyball i stubbed my finger so yeah and it was like the second day i had them on so that's fine anyways yeah um i really don't know what to talk about i feel like get ready me is like nobody watches them anymore like i don't know guys i'm out maybe it's just mine because mine are boring sorry bro this hoodie actually makes me look super big back like <sighs> anyways i look like insane right now like i just don't look well today so yeah. everyone keeps asking for a room tour guys but there's really nothing to my room but maybe i'll do one but i've been saying that for like years i just like there's my room's so boring and i still have like a bunch of stuff because i had a bunch of posters up and then they all fell down so i need to get double-sided tape to hang them back up so maybe once those get hung up i'll show you guys my room but my room is, room is really tiny and it's really crowded because like i have so much stuff like, it's not as exciting as you guys think it is. I also have a huge Sheen haul coming soon. Um, sadly, I don't think I got a box because, yeah, because it said there was two packages. So I think I just got two huge packages. But I'm very excited. It's like my summer, spring, like, haul, you know, and today's. Anyways, I don't even know what I'm talking about, to be honest. I feel so, like, 
dead right now. I need to get a new eyebrow pencil because mine's literally gone. I might get that one that's like a gel and it's tinted. So it's a lot easier to use than having to draw and then do gel. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Bro, you're a bot. I feel like my eyebrows actually look kind of good today, guys. I haven't done my makeup. That's a lie. But I feel like I haven't been like actually... I just glitch. Guys, I also have to get have to get a new eyelash curler. This one's Josie's. Mine is like brick broken. So I don't know. But I'm really excited to come back from spring break because not gonna lie, I miss my friends. Like I don't miss school because like I don't wanna do work. But I miss my friends. Like I just miss my friends. And yeah, I'm really I have like an outfit planned for the first day back. Cause I just got these new leggings. They're flares from Victoria's Secret, and they're really cute. Cause I wanted to get the bedazzled one from, ones from Pink, and we thought we had the worker order them, and she thought they were them, but they weren't. Anyways, yeah, guys, my get ready me used to be so entertaining, and now they're not. Like I'm not even entertained. Cause I used to have so much stuff to talk about, and now I really don't. Like my life is boring. It's okay, guys, cause this summer I'm going to literally be lit. Like these summers. Get ready means they're going to be lit. But not right now. And like I can't tell you guys juicy stuff because my parents are on this account. Yeah. Peace out. Bye guys. Full transparency, y'all, yesterday was not my best day. And there's, like, tornado watches and everything, so yesterday was just not a good day as a whole. But today's a new day, and I'm up a couple hours before class, so hopefully I am able to change that today. It already looks good because it looks a little sunny out. Oh, yeah, it's super sunny. This is the first morning I've actually woken up well rested in a while, so I'm feeling really good today. Thank you to my aura ring for tracking it, y'all. I've been loving it. Go ahead and buy it. It's on my Amazon store. Fine. I'm honestly running so low on that serum, but the Sephora sale is coming up. You can shop all my products in my like to know it if you want to check out what's for sale at Sephora. The weather is back in the 60s today, so I'm going to wear something warmer. I have two classes today, Pilates and then a meeting. And then I also have another meeting right after that one. So it's going to be a really nice day. Here is my outfit for the day. I love this set. Per usual, it'll be linked in my like to know it. I'm gonna go ahead and head out to class, but I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. Get ready to meet for school. I'm just gonna skip the rest of my skincare, like all my serums. I have my toner moisturizer, but I just don't feel like doing anything else. But I got so much sleep last night. I went to bed at 9.30 because I took melatonin and I just, like, was really tired. And I stayed asleep the whole night and I still cannot wake up this morning. This is the first day of the week when my hair, my hair is going to be straight. I straightened it last night, so I don't have to straighten it this morning. By the way, I slept in 30 minutes, and I still could not wake up this morning. I have a stupid quiz in math, and when I say I don't know what we're doing in math at all, I have no idea what we're doing. Like, we've had multiple substitutes, and we had, like, a teacher, like, quit. So it's just, like, after that, I just pretty much get my brain is given up on math, because... I don't even know what we're doing at all. And I don't even bother trying to, like... I mean, I do bother trying to, like... I talk to my teacher, but, like... I don't know. Because after this quiz, I'm going to be failing math. And she's like, it's it's angles. It's easy. It's not easy, actually. And then all the nerds in the class are like, Oh, my God, so easy. Ha, ha. Be so for real. Like, it's not easy. Anyways, I just have today, tomorrow, and then the next day. 
but I can't even have a good weekend because I have a competition for cheer. And I literally spend all my weekends on that stupid cheer stuff. Like an in-depth makeup routine because people are like asking and I just haven't done it. Look at my lashes, they look so good. Why there's random highlighter spots on me. I'm just gonna do a highlighter and then I'm pretty much done. I gave myself way too much time this morning. I could have slept in like another half hour. Okay. Here's my hair. I think I'm just gonna talk about my ears because I can't really deal with it right now. Like being in my face. We're doing 40. I forgot that I tint on my lips. But yeah, I'm done. I'm actually gonna do more Laneige. What it's like marrying a Turkish man. I'm Mexican and we live in New York, but we definitely have a lot of differences. Out of nowhere, I'll hear like, oh, yeah. I think it's the Spanish version of yeah, which I use all the time. I feel like the English vocabulary is missing a lot of these expressions. Okay, another thing he starts saying, he'll literally go, oh, ha. I'm like, are you singing? Like, what are you doing? Oh, ha. So we have oh, yeah, and oh, ha. I'll be like, Ari, can you take me to Sephora? I really need to go. And then he'll say, oh, yeah. This next one is like the most annoying one. Like actually it makes me cringe. Also, I'm about to apply this luminous soap foundation. It is so good. He goes, I know I've mentioned it in my videos, but I can't get over it. So I'll ask like, are you still gonna meet your friends tonight? And he'll say, what is, and so I figured out that it means no. Also something really funny that I was doing that he was so confused by is when I said yes, like this. We use it in Mexico a lot. It is so funny dating someone from another culture because you learn so much, like all these different expressions. But what I love the most about marrying a Turk is that I get to go to Turkey every summer. I really love Turkish food. Not as much as Mexican, but it's good. Oh, and also he always says, Yanni. I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, but something like that, Yanni. Yanni. I love doing like lip liner and then just lip balm on top. This is the summer Fridays. Giving mascara. And then people always ask me if after eight years I've learned any Turkish and the answer is probably just 10 things. Merhaba, günaydın, seni seviyorum, çok güzel, teşekkürler. I don't even know how to say bye. Get ready with me in Finland to go ice carding and ice floating. <laughs> it is exactly what it sounds like. My view right now, what is life? Brand new moisturizer. The weather here does not play. I thought it was cold in Jersey. No, it is freezing here. For ice carting, it's literally go-karting, but on ice. Ever since I flew off the snowmobile and almost died, I'm kind of nervous to do any icing activities. I was gonna say I feel like I'm in another world, but I really am in another world. I always do this, like I should just put on foundation. <laughs> Brought my room service coffee, but didn't bring me a mug, so I'm drinking it out of the creamer. It took us actually 24 hours to get to our destination. The time difference is insane. Seven hours ahead. This hotel is literally a treehouse. Everyone gets their own room, which is so nice, and we're all next to each other. On the way here, my my seat on the plane was a bed. There was so much going through my head that I could not sleep to save my life. They gifted us the entire outfit for today and it's like a nice neutral snow outfit. You're like, how are you always rushing? I don't know how I'm always rushing. I thought we had to be ready at 12 and now we have to be ready at 11.45. Mascara is on and it looks like I'm going to the club, but it's fine. Setting my lip liner so there's laws in the water. Setting spray. I'm kind of nervous, guys. This is the final look. Go to part two for outfit. Wish me luck. <laughs> Love you guys. Bye.